Assalamu alaikum Geo 34 channel this is Malik Arjun today I am going to show you a quick installation demonstration on 11 to 4 standalone grid infrastructure installation it has a 4 parts part 1 contain grid infrastructure installation part 2 contain db home installation part 3 contain database creation part 4 contain creation of listener and adding them to the cluster where if you are new to my channel I request you to go back to youtube and search for Malik 034 and then please do subscribe if you like my video please like share and comment already logged into my server and then already downloaded 11.204 grid infrastructure binaries and I already unzipped them so here is the binaries and already created Oracle user it has a O install as a primary group and O install and DB as a secondary group and DB node 2 is my host name and then 192.168.8.128 is my IP address and already created a grid home user own app 11.204 grid and already created my database home user own app Oracle product 11.204 DB home and let's get started with the installation Here you go the run installer screen. I am going to skip software update. I am going to select grid infrastructure for standalone servers. And by default English is a language. And I am going to discover my ASM disk. Oracle ASM dash disk dash star. Okay, I got a record disk and data disk. I'm going to select data. I'm going to external redundancy. I'm going to give same password for sys 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 sm. I'm going to select O install for all. Okay. Ether and app oracle is my base location and software location is going to be Ether and app 11.204 grid click next ok user and app or inventory is my inventory location click ok it's doing pre-checks now Okay, pre checks are success. I'm going to proceed with the installation. It has uh, four steps preparation, copying files, and linking binaries. Linking binaries includes linking your all executables, libraries, binaries, everything it will link here. And then uh, it will set it will do a setup of configuration files. And then it will ask us to run the root upgrade.ss script. Sorry, root.ss script. So after we run root upgrade, root, root.ss script, it will proceed with the uh, grid infrastructure installation for standalone server can monitor using this detail screen the copying completed and now the linking binaries is in progress you can see this it is linking all these binaries ok so the linking binaries is done and then setting up files are done and then now I got a root.ss script I am going to run it now taking a new terminal as a root user and I'm running here for I nest root.sh okay and I'm running second script just enter creating a test directory okay node 2 is successfully pinned adding cluster entries into any tab Okay, so successfully configured uh, grid infrastructure for standalone and then also OLR got created and I'm going back and I'm click uh, I'm clicking OK. Okay, started with the uh, updating inventory and then it start with the uh, net configuration assistant for listener and then it will uh, start with the ASNCA. Okay, inventory updated and listener got created and now it is proceeding with automatic storage ASMCA yes uh, ASM configuration assistant utility completed and then uh, I got a success message here I'll just close it and then I'll just verify my ASM is running here I will log in to Oracle user I'll just verify my Vara tab entry Vara tab entry is added 
I'll just check my environment. Plus SM. I'll just try to log in to SM as SM. Unable to log into SM. I'll try to run uh, RSCPL chat resource hyphen P. Yep, it's running. That's it, guys. Thank you.